Martian mathematics. They decided to give simply everything a number. They thought that this would mightily improve things. Such work might take a while, but it would be worth it. All manner of things became plausible with numbers. Anything conceivable could be made out of a number. To space, they gave, at first, three numbers, though these were flexible, negatable. To time, they gave but one little seed of a number, an insignificant crumb sewn a long way behind them. But it grew rapidly and soon caught up, then sped on into the distance so far they couldn't see its end, and would have been wholly unmanageable except they only ever cut from their very thin slices to put into service as and when required. With such numbers, they could do fantastic things. They clashed tiny numbers together at increasing speeds to see what other numbers might fall out. They made a fine incision in one long number, then fed in smaller numbers to ride round inside it. And in this way, it made numbers that work extraordinary. Impossibly intricate, clearly incredible numbers, numbers the likes of which had never been seen. And though they still haven't found a sustainable method by which to convert these new numbers that may be back into something useful, into something tangible, that didn't matter. With flawless adherence, with stringent endeavor, they hoped yet to live out their dream of a world broken down into standardized modular units. So much easier that way to bring things to order. So much easier to mold 